Hello again, dear first students. This is Miss Myra, your teacher in math. And I hope that you are safe and healthy while watching this video. Today, we are going to talk about adding several numbers using pairs of numbers to make 10 or 20. Learning objectives. At the end of this lesson, students should be able to add several numbers using pairs of numbers to make 10 or 20 and solve word problems involving adding several numbers using pairs of numbers to make 10 or 20. Let us have a short recall about the past lesson. So let's see if you can still add and subtract groups of tens, hundreds, and thousands. So these are the given numbers and these are the numbers that you're going to add or subtract. Okay, let's do the first one. So in 6,734 minus 100 equals, yes, it's 6,634. The second one we have 1,265 plus 20, the answer is 1,285. Good job. The next one we have 978 plus 1,000, which makes 1,978. And the third one, or the fourth one we have, 4,315 plus 700 equals 5,015. And the last one we have 9,534 minus 1,000 equals 8,534. If you all, if you got all the correct answers, you are very good. Now let's go to our main lesson or our main topic which is adding several numbers. So look at this illustration. So each bead represents a number. So for example, so we have here three plus four plus six equals 13. Then three plus six plus four equals 13 and six plus three plus four equals 13. This only shows that you can add numbers in any order and at the same time, you can still get the same answer. Okay, and when you have to add three or four small numbers, you can add them in pairs. What do I mean by that? So if you find pairs that add up to 10 or 20, it makes addition easier. So the first thing that we're going to do is we are going to find pairs of numbers. Okay, so like for example, we have six plus five plus four. So we have here six and four. So what are we going to do with this with these uh, two numbers? We have to add them first. Okay, so if we add six plus four equals 10, then we're going to add the five more. So 10 plus five equals 15. Another example, we have 13 plus eight plus seven. So what are the pairs of numbers that add up to 10 or 20? So add first 13, plus seven, which will make 20, plus we still have eight more. So 20 plus eight will make 28. How about if we have four plus nine plus seven plus one? So we have nine and one. What are we going to do with this one again, with these two numbers? Yes, we are going to add them first. So nine plus one will make 10. Then we're going to add the remaining numbers. So let's add 10 plus 7 equals 17. Then 17 plus 4 equals 21. Now, if you cannot add it uh, at once in your mind, you can count on if you need to. Okay, I hope that you understand that you have to find first the pairs of numbers that add up to 10 or 20 before adding several numbers. Okay, let's try answering student book four, page 43, question one. Okay, let's do this all together. We have to add these numbers. And the first thing that we're going to do is to try to find pairs that make 10 or 20 and add them first. Okay, in letter A, we have seven plus three plus 11 or seven plus 11 plus three equals 21 because 
7 plus 3 equals 10 plus 11 equals 21. In letter B, we have 9 plus 7 plus 1 equals 17 because 9 plus 1 equals 10 plus 7 equals 17. Now in letter C, we have 5 plus 8 plus 5 equals 18 because 5 plus 5 equals 10 plus 8 equals 17. In letter D, we have 8 plus 6 plus 2 equals 16 because 8 plus 2 equals 10 plus 6 equals 16. In letter E, we have 7 plus 5 plus 3 equals 15 because 7 plus 3 equals 10 plus 5 equals 15. Let's go now to letter F. So we have here 6 plus 3 plus 4 equals, yes, it's 23 because 6 plus 4 equals 10 plus 13 equals 23. Now we go to letter G. We have 2 plus 11 plus 8 equals 21 because 2 plus 8 equals 10 plus 11 equals 21. In letter H, we have 8 plus 7 plus 12 equals, good job, it's 27 because 8 plus 2 equals 20 plus 7 equals 27. In letter I, we have 9 plus 6 plus 11 equals 26 because 9 plus 11 equals 20 plus 6 equals 26. In letter J, we have 7 plus 5 plus 13 equals 25 because 7 plus 13 equals 20 plus 5 equals 25. In letter K, we have 15 plus 6 plus 5 equals 26 because 15 plus 5 equals 20 plus 6 equals 26. And the last one, we have 14 plus 7 plus 6 equals 27. Very good. Because 14 plus 6 equals 20 plus 7 equals 27. Yes. Okay. I hope now that you can add several numbers by yourself. Okay. Can you try? Let us check your progress first. Can you try answering question two of page 43 again? I'm giving you enough time to answer these questions. And then we're going to check your answers afterwards. You can pause this video while you are answering the questions A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay, let's try to check your answers now. So let's add these several numbers. In letter A, we have four plus seven plus three plus nine. The answer is 23. If you got the correct answer, you are really very good. Why did we, how did we get 23? Because seven plus three equals 10, plus nine equals 19, plus four equals 23. In letter B, we have 6 plus 6 plus 8 plus 2. If your answer is 22, it's correct. You are very good because 8 plus 2 is 10, plus 6 equals 16, plus 6 equals 22. How about letter C? It's 6 plus 8 plus 14 plus 3 equals, yes, good job, it's 31. How did you do that? Because 6 plus 14 equals 20, plus 8 equals 28, plus 3 equals 31. In letter D, we have 9 plus 5 plus 11 plus 3 equals, good job, it's 28. Because 9 plus 11 equals 20, plus 5 equals 25, plus 3 equals 28. In letter E, we have 12 plus 7 plus 8 plus 3. And the answer is, yes, it's 30. How did we get that one? Because 12 plus 8 equals 20 and 7 plus 3 equals 10. So 20 plus 10 equals 30. And the last one we have, 13 plus 9 plus 7 plus 1. What is your answer? Yes, it's 30 also. How did we get 30? Because 13 plus 7 equals 20. And then 9 plus 1 equals 10. 
So if we add 20 and 10, it will make 30. Good job, everyone. Now let's go on with the problem solving. Now this problem is linked to some school theme, which is respect. So during the school's assembly, students are gathered in the football field. While Bahrain national anthem is being played, I saw 14 students standing up properly. Six students were singing wholeheartedly and three of them were looking at the flag. How many children showed respect? Okay, so what are you going to do with 14 plus and six and three? Since the, the, the problem is how many children showed respect? Okay, so we're going to add them up. So again, the first thing that we're going to do is to find the pairs that add up to 10 or 20. So if we have 14 and six, we have 20 plus three, the answer will be, yes, it's 23, good job. Okay guys, I hope that by now, you really learned how to add several numbers using pairs of numbers to make 10 and 20. So I'm leaving you these closing thoughts. What did you learn today and what part of the lesson did you like best? Okay, goodbye everyone and have a nice day.